Welcome, Lion Camp Cowboy Church friends and family, to another daily devotion. Today it's 1 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 9. Chip, this scripture says, I has not seen nor ear heard, nor have entered into the heart of man the things which God has prepared for those who love him. What, what a beautiful verse of scripture with promise. But as you hear that, Chip, what do you think? Well, I'll tell you what I think. Uh, I think a lot of times of a vacation, if I can imagine right now, and, and I've been fortunate enough to be able to travel, and, and I kind of know ahead of time, I can look at some pictures, I can talk to somebody that's been there, and I, and I see what it looks like. And so I kind of got an idea when I get there, or I can hear, somebody can, you know, again, tell me, or I listen to the radio, or listen to the TV, and I, and I got an idea. Um, but when you, when you get the, and you know, maybe my heart knows, man, if I go down there, the water's gonna be so blue, mm -hmm. and the fishing's gonna be good, or the diving is just gonna be great. You know, I, I just know kind of what it's gonna be. Well, what we're talking about here is, is when you get to heaven, we all kind of have an imagination and so yeah. forth, and we think that, but we truly in our hearts don't know. But if we'll follow the word, uh, we're gonna get there, and we're gonna find out that it's more glorious than anything that we've ever seen, any vacation that we've ever went on, uh, and you know everybody's just going to be so much happier and better and and just so nicer <laughs> and nicer. Yeah, I'll, I'll go there. But I, that, that's what it means to me is, is that uh, it's just beyond belief, and, and you can't even imagine truly what it is. I remember when my dad passed away. This is the first time I ever heard this song. That's now very popular. It had just come out then. It's called "I Can Only Imagine." Lion Camp Cowboy Church. I want you to know that you have a promise for tomorrow. You have a promise for tomorrow, for eternity, that's like no promise you've ever had before. I trust you will claim 1 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 9. Write it down and read it. It's for those who love Him. Will you pray with me today? Heavenly Father, we thank You for Your love, grace, and Your mercy. And Father, we thank You for the promises that we have in Your Word. Father, I do ask You to continue to heal this nation, both physically and spiritually. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Line Camp Cowboy Church, you be blessed.